I'm working, right? Boom. So I start off. I'm working this lock. Let's say I had it from an open guard. My foot's right against my heel. Boom. If I wanted to switch, look, if I don't have a hip to push off of, I can push shin to the head. I could, see this, he's fighting, I lift my leg up. I hook it here. Any way I want to trap, I could, his legs are up, I could catch his leg. I start to pull that. Right? And then if he goes to roll, I can pull it flat. If he goes to roll here, I take it away. That's all I'm doing. And there's good torque. Right? And then you can start locking. You can take that away. That takes away roll two. That takes away roll. And that's it. So I just want to get that good. As a Japanese Jiu Jitsu, that's one of the key arresting positions. Si tu veux garder quelqu'un au sol pour une arrestation, c'est une bonne, une bonne technique. So play with it. It doesn't always have to be beautiful. Be slow. Be safe. In that position. He tries to rule. He goes to rule, right? You move which way? So look, this way. And your legs don't have to be crossed. You're in the shin box. If they're crossed, you gotta be like that. You're in the shin box, and you just move down. Même chose avec les bras. If you're here like that, imagine. Il commence. Souvent, les personnes vont forcer. Look, they force down, and he's gonna roll right up. Parce que je vais donner un point de rotation. So I gotta push into him, pull that. Okay. You want to you want to You extend the joint, it separates. Very good. Muy bien. Muy bien. Muy bien. What a manly mat today. Like a testosterone farm in here. You can you watch, you can put, put your foot right by his face. This one? Yeah. So let's say you put it, you're more yeah. flexible than that. Okay. You're not going to have enough. Let's say that's all the way under, you're laying down your side. Right? You don't have enough to adjust your legs. Yeah, exactly. So your legs job now, your foot can lift up a bit into his face. Yeah. Your knee squeeze, that goes in his chest. How can you finish it with this? Where do you exactly? So now you cramp exactly, you start to cramp. That's it. And if he rolls out, you're going right into an arm. But which is here? Right in there. Box on the rug, baby. Kev. Yes, sir. So I broke your JV already, didn't you? No. So, no pressure, but you're messing up my logo when you're on this. This will get it. So, I'm like this, and I wanted to sell here and the left. Like, I. So, look, if, if you had the flip, just games, yeah. right? Yeah. What can you do to get this under here? Okay. Games. What can you do with your right knee to squish up into his chest, right? That's it. If worst case scenario, if he rolls out, yeah, we're gonna go to a hundred different arm wrestles. Okay, okay. Yeah. So for now, yeah. the way to keep him from rolling is yeah. to keep it locked up. To keep it locked up. You can, if your leg is not locked, you're trying to get this out from underneath the rubble. Yeah. You can put weight here. Lift your butt off the ground here. Yes. That stops him, right? Yeah. That's good. If you slip in, now let's say JB, as he brings this in, bunny hop over. Yeah. Now hook up. No, don't go completely. Oh. Do step by step. You can hook as soon as it comes through. Swiss blade. Oh, yeah. Swiss blade in the aim. Yes. Wow. Look at that. What does he right? mean? You still have it, right? So even if he rolls now, if he slips out over that, you still have this. So you're just your right knee can push up on his chest. And if, you, if the knees can only hold him there, then the arms have to do the break. That's it. Now look at that. Yeah, so watch. Take your time even here. So watch this. Just this. See, you're not under his face, but there's a little bit under. What can you do gently to lift his teeth up? That'll take his roll away because now you're deforming his spine the other way. His head has to go down to roll. If you lift it up, he can't roll. Thank you. Ooh. Yeah.